Good morning, everyone. Today is Dr. Barry's birthday, December 9, 2020. We're gonna go out tonight and celebrate, so we're gonna take you along for that. I'm excited, we're going to our favorite restaurant in Nashville, Jeff Ruby, and we're just gonna relax and have fun and try to forget about the fact that we haven't been out in I don't know how long, but we're excited to finally get out of the house and go celebrate him. Uh, Jeffrey B is wonderful, clean, safe. They take all the proper precautions and all that good stuff. And uh, so we're really excited to get out and have a birthday celebration for my sweet husband. And then, yeah, so that's, we're just gonna take you along. And I'm also cutting his hair today, so I'll show you how I cut Dr. Barry's hair at home. <laughs> and yeah, that, that will be this vlog, majority of it. I wanna say a huge thank you to everyone who watched my Christmas song on my singing channel. I've spent the greater part of the morning trying to respond to all the comments because you guys uh, showed me so much love on it, which is crazy and amazing. Uh, that video has over 11,000 views right now, which is insane. That does. That video is doing better than most of my videos do on this channel and I have hardly any subscribers over there so that means you guys are listening to it and enjoying it and that makes me very happy. Um, my next song will be Oh Holy Night and then I'm working on Mary Did You Know so if you're interested in hearing those head over there hit that subscribe button and those will be coming soon. Again thank you so much it uh, really made my day. <laughs> All right, I'll check back in with you when we're cutting Kenny D's hair for his birthday haircut. <laughs> Happy birthday! What are you going? <laughs> 25. Yes, sort of. It's close. Depends on how you look at it. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Tom. We don't believe in age and years, do we, baby? No, no. I'm sure my telomere age and my glycan age are not what my chronological age is. <laughs> You're only as old as you feel. And act. And act. Well, yeah. you'll be 12 the rest of your life then. <laughs> That's true. <clears throat> you ready for a haircut? Uh, what do you think? Oh my gosh. It's think so I need a haircut? I think you do. Plus you want to look good for our date night tonight. Yeah, steak and sashimi. Sashimi. And maybe a drink or two. Drink or two. But this is getting old. We keep doing that in like every vlog. We need to watch that again. What movie is that even Bad from? Enough. Oh. That's Grin Grindel. Oh, that's Remember? a good name. Harmed him not. Yes, I, I remember. Maybe sheep or two. Beowulf, but I forget. I don't know. The way you say it doesn't sound like. <laughs> okay, let's go get your hair. Your tag is sticking out. So I've been doing his hair since. We first went into quarantine, which was what, February? Yep. March? I don't remember. March. I guess April. I blocked that out. Um, so we use this clipper. Is it a clipper? I see, look, I'm not a yeah, beautician. It's, it's a clipper, I guess. I don't know. I'm not a professional. I've literally just learned on the fly. <laughs> but I've kind of got a technique down at this point, so. Need a towel. You like it wet like this? To make it yeah, better? just as long as it's not bedhead. That's what really messes it up because your hair goes like seven different ways when you wake up. <laughs> Do I get a clip? Do you want a clip? No, I'm good. Alright, here we go. Your hair grows so fast. I know. It's all that meat, baby. It is. Mine grows fast, too. So does Beckett. Beckett's... We're not cutting his hair, though, are we? No. Not anytime soon.
This is where Dr. Barry gets nervous. <laughs> yeah, for good reason. Because sometimes I, I get him. I'm getting better though. Did your granddaddy ever call it getting his ears lowered? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> I had one of these when granddaddy was still alive and I used to get him out in the backyard once a week and cut his hair. Once a week? Because he was an army boy. And so if, you had, high if you had long hair, you were not <laughs> favored by the creator. You had to have a short hair. I don't know. Took a before picture. You did. You can use for the thumbnail. We hate. Good. What do you think? So your forever face? Yeah, my forever face. <laughs> ah, not too shabby, not too shabby. Does it look pretty good? It looks pretty good. Who, you know, isn't a hairstylist. Yeah. If you're a hairstylist and you watch this and you were screaming at me <laughs> because I was doing something wrong, I'm very sorry. You know, I am a nurse by trade, so it is what it is. It is what it is. I think you look good, babe. You're pretty. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. I accept that. You look beautiful oh. for your birthday. Oh. What do you want me to wear tonight? Hmm. Something A dress. sexy. So, sweatpants. <laughs> not, not comfy. Not comfy. <laughs> I'm going to pick out something great because I have, like, Three new dresses that, you know, have just sat in my closet for six yeah. months. You need to break them in. Yep. Proper Human Diet. Boom. Shameless plug. It's just, we did a Proper Human Diet Summit virtual summit. <clears throat> and we did that in September. But now you can purchase it for the replay. And watch it as much as you want to. It gets sent to your email. And you can share it with your family members if you want to. We don't care. Yep. Super cheap. Full of information. Yeah, well, you know, cheap's in the eye of the beholder, so. True. Very valuable, it's yet valuable. inexpensive. It's $39.95. Buy it for your family, buy it for your friends, buy it for your enemy, you know. Yeah, because if you're one of these, then you should eat this. And then you'll have a in PhD. Okay. What are you going to wear tonight? You need some new clothes. T-shirt. Yeah, you need to buy me some clothes. I know. Okay. Hi, <laughs> it's me. Uh, I am fixing to get ready for date night because I need to put on some makeup and like wash my hair, maybe put on a different outfit because I'm all sweatpants. Um, where are y'all barking at? Anyways, I want to talk about something that happened today to me on Facebook. Oh, hi. Why are y'all barking at him? He lives here. Anyways, somebody told me today that they didn't believe that I ate keto anymore and I was. Oh, yay. I'll unbox that. I'll unbox that for you. And then I was faking it. Throw down in fields. Face stuff. Um, so I was like, I haven't checked my ketones in a while. I'm going to check them and post a video in response to that comment. Because I was like. What? Because I posted about, oh, hello, Keto Bakery. Because everybody wants to buy their stuff and they sell out so quickly. So I post when they restock. Anyway, so I tested my ketones. <laughs> this is what my ketones were. <laughs> 5.5. 5. 
5.1. I was like, ketone drop. Anyways, I made a video and I posted on Facebook because I'm sassy like that. Honestly, I just wanted to make a post about how everybody needs to like respect that there are some people that can get away with things and some people that can't. We got to know, can I eat a keto bakery treat or can I not? Lucky for me, I can. Unlucky for this one over here, he cannot. Isn't that right? That's right. Did you make a video? I did. What did you make a video about? I uh, tore apart the new meat causes heart disease study that's in the British Medical Journal. Mm, that'll be a good one. All right, it's almost time for date night. Yay! Are you excited? Yes. Me too. Will there be steak? There will be steak. Will there be sashimi? Look, I dressed up for you. Oh, my God. Look at my shoes, too! This so is, sexy. This is my... This is just, so sexy. This is the best way to turn on Kim Berry's sweatpants and ugly house shoes. Grandma shoes. Yeah. Don't don't worry. I'm going to transform. At least my That'd hair be a good reel. The transformation. Oh my gosh, you're right. Yeah. I'm gonna do that. Excuse me. <laughs> okay. Oh, I said I was gonna open this. I don't have a knife do you have a knife you, oh my ketone thing just went flying a lot of you guys ask what kind of stuff i use on my face i use a lot of rodan and fields i know they get a bad rep here's the thing i sell it so i don't actually have to talk to anybody i do it because i get the discount and i genuinely like the stuff it really works their eye cream this is the best eye cream i've ever used in my life i actually use it all over my face so I do use it uh, if you know somebody who sells it and you don't think they'll bug the crap out of you, give their eye cream a try because it really is worth it. And then, oh, this is Lash Boost. It's not for me. I don't use their Lash Boost. I use the one I talked about in my uh, Best of 2020 video. But Morgan Elizabeth, she really likes their Lash Boost. So I got her some Lash Boost. And then I got the redefined line because mine was in the farmhouse, so I don't have any anymore. I just have the eye cream. And so I got overnight cream and a triple defense cream. And I guess I got an extra lash boost. No, no, no. I got one for Abby and I got one for Morgan because they both wanted some in their stocking for Christmas. So that's what was in my box. I'm going to do a real, a transformation of frumpy to fabulous. By request. See you in a minute. Okay, we're ready to go. This is my outfit, my shoes, my mask. My mask matches my outfit. Not planned, but it's cute. <laughs> What's up? Are you ready? <laughs> yeah, I was just listening to a podcast. Oh, I'm so surprised. <laughs> was it about farming? Uh, no, this one's about carnivores versus vegans. Oh, okay. Yeah. Research, you know. Yeah. Exciting stuff. <laughs> We've both been fasting all day long so we can break our fast with Jeff Ruby amazingness. I'm so excited. I'm freaking hungry. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. Let's do it. 